boom, boom, Think I'm wise now. Alright, so we're live, and we're going to be doing some more Dragon Age 2. Uh, I had to reload a save, because our last save, there was a bug. Uh, we didn't get the right key, or the key didn't drop at all. So, I had to reload it, but let's hop back into it. Oh, you loaded the wrong save. Let's see. Yeah, we're gonna have to start here. Okay. Yes. About that. Come and face me. Chandra's is so angry and shouting. Oh. There we go. Let's restart. Switch our own character. to do his fighting for him. Yep. Denarius, can you hear me? Your pets cannot stop us. I'll still not get over him being the named over Daenerys Targaryen. Same name. Oh, right, we have to go down this, because I forgot. Pummel strike. That. Uh, oh. There we go. Got those ones. Auto save or quick save. We shall continue. Gonna die in a second. Come on, help. Help, Ocean, please. Yes. Ready to meet my ancestors. Thank God. So 
save again. Oh my god, no, that's not true. Stop it. <sighs> Getting bullied. Thankfully, thank god, I got the key this time. Okay, cool, the game didn't glitch. Game did not glitch this time, thank god. Good. Oh my god, there's more? Finally, continue with other rooms. Oh, right, right, okay. More now. Um. Cool. That's better than what I had. It's fire damage. I don't have anyone that uses fire though.
thought that. Hi, Candy. How are you? Yes, I did. I finished or oh, uh, ugh, words. They evade me. Uh, yes, I finished Origins. A couple, about a week ago? A week and a half ago? And we kind of like played a couple other games while I was working up to doing too. Yeah, it's good. And I'm so far I'm as someone who hasn't I hadn't played this for years. I find it uh, the combat system in this game to be much more satisfying. That's the best way I put it. I can put it so far. It's not bad. The first one wasn't bad at all, but I find this one just a lot more satisfying personally. I would love for this to be one of the games that gets remastered, especially because uh, one of BioWare's big games just got announced or remastered. I don't know if you saw, but Knights of the Old Republic is being remastered. So it would be nice if Origins, all the other ones, got remastered. Did you not see that? They got uh, announced. <laughs> got announced today at uh, PlayStation. It's gonna be a PlayStation exclusive. It's gonna be a PlayStation Five exclusive for like. I don't know how long, they haven't specified yet, but it's going to be PlayStation exclusive at launch, and then it's going to come to... I don't know if it's coming to Xbox, but I know it is coming to PC. Set. Yeah, it's... I was very confused at that. Because I was like, wait, when did we... Get the exclusive rights to that. But I don't I don't even have a PS5 yet, so like I took the money I was gonna buy use to get a PS5 and put it towards my PC. Assume Daenerys left valuables behind. Take them if you wish. I need some air. Oh, okay, Fenris. I feel like we need like more constitution. It's very low. Um, but yeah, I'm excited for it, but I'm also a little bit disappointed. Oh no! You're, you're poor PS5. I'm sorry about that. So.
I remember staying up. I was very, very, like, sold on, like, getting a PS5 at launch. Uh, and I got it in my cart. I got it. I got went to checkout. Everything. I got the confirmation email. And then the next morning, because I had stayed up for, like, 24 hours trying to get it. And I finally went to bed. And I wake up to an email saying, they oversold it. And I was very, I was so sad. And I kept trying and trying for like months, and I never got it. But yeah, I was very, it was, it was, I got it from Target, and I was very pissed at Target. Because the guy I reached out to was just on top of it, just rude. Like telling me, oh, just because I got a confirmation email saying it was confirmed, doesn't mean it's confirmed. Which is very dismissive and just rude. So that kind of left a bad taste in my mouth as well, especially for Target in general. Yeah, he was like, oh, well, unless it has a pickup date, it's not confirmed. I'm like, but it's a confirmation email. It says so at the top. Confirmation. My, like, my bank is already, like, the money what got taken out, it was already pending. Like, how is it not confirmed? And our big theory behind it was, like, they either A, oversold it, or B, one of the employees took the one that was meant for me. But they're like, oh, no, no. Just to say you don't have it. That was, like, our big theory. Because my friend and I had stayed up for, like, 24 hours doing every single launch. The very first day I came out. It is. But, you know. Sorry about your PS5. That sounds like a shitty situation to be in. But hope you at least made some memories on it. I'm sure you'll get another one if you want to. It never ends. I escaped a land of dark magic, only to have it hunt me at every turn. It is a plague burned into my flesh and my soul. And now I find myself in the company of yet another mage. Oh. I saw you casting spells inside. I should have realized sooner what you really were. Oh no. Tell you me gotta hate what us. manner of mage are you? What is it that you seek? We were supposed to make Fenris like us and he already hates us immediately. If I finish up early, I'll definitely have to check out yours. Uh, there is a exclamation point lurk command now. I added that. So, whenever you stop by and you need to lurk, there's that. I know how to greet you. I know you're there. Hope you have a great stream, though. Uh, find out. I don't know. What do you think I seek? You are skilled. I know that much. We're not all the same, nor are we worthy of your scorn. I imagine I appear ungrateful. If so, I apologize, for nothing could be further from the truth. I did not find Denarius, but I still owe you a debt. Here is all the coin I have, as I so promised. Should you find yourself in need of assistance, I would gladly render it. You didn't seem all that thrilled with me a moment ago. You are not Denarius. Whether you are anything like it remains to be seen. Why does that sound so squeaky when I talk about that? Okay, um, investigate. 
Your old master must want something more than just a runaway slave. He doesn't want me at all, just the markings on my skin. <laughs> they are lyrium, burned into my flesh to provide the much power that story. Darius required of his pet. And now, he wishes his precious investment returned, even if he must rip it from my corpse. Seems like a waste of a perfectly handsome elf. We're flirting with Fenris. <laughs> The truth is, I romance and uh, Anders last time I played this. I regret that. It was Daenerys's choice. Well, I don't regret that. Regrets. I don't regret it because Anders is Anders is a good ba boy in his own way, just doing wrong things. Uh, tell me about it. You said Daenerys is a magister, but little else. In Tevinter, the magisters Hi, hold the power. Over the oh, chantry, good girl. over the imperial one scratches over life scratches. itself. It is nothing for one to own a slave. Daenerys had many, but none he valued so much as me. Then how did you get away? Hmm. Is it not enough that I did? I carved my path to freedom in blood. I left that life behind. Yet his bounty certain. hunters follow me no matter where I go. I, think I was just asking because I want to no know how you longer. escaped. I've seen some of your abilities. Do they come from those markings? Some. All I know is that even okay. in the Imperium, warriors such as myself are rare. Perhaps they believe I should feel honored. Hmm. Okay. All the hunters are turned. your master will keep chasing you? He is too proud not to. Oh, kitty. Perhaps one day Thank the you for the cost him more than he is willing to pay. Oh, the kisses on my leg. Uh... I can use your help. We definitely want friend of us. He's a good boy. I'm planning an expedition I might need help with. Fair enough. Should you ever have need of me, I will be here. If Daenerys wishes his mansion back, he is free to return and claim it. Fucking power Beyond moves. That, I am at your disposal. I need to fix my uh far oracle. I think it gets fucked up because of all the bots. Um, I like Meryl, but no. So we're gonna have. I like you, Meryl, but we'll swap you out and rotate him. But for now, we're gonna have Fenris, Aveline, and Beric. Always calling and getting rid of idiots, especially thugs who target the streets just because it's dark. Oh, why they give rivalry points? Huh. Uh, give her more strength. Is it this? Yes. Immune to. Oh! Immune to critical hits. Nice. Make it very tanky. Alright, we're gonna quick save, and I have to run to the bathroom, and I'm gonna grab some more tissues while I'm there. So, I will be right back.
All right, we are back. We'll continue. Yes, the other one I had, I remember now. We have. Excuse me. We have the. Anders quest. Um, yes. Okay. Sorry about that. I'm just re-pulling up my stream because I had to do something with it. Stop in a second to do it's our text messages, but that's okay. We'll work it out. I saw Carl go inside a few minutes ago. Anders. No Templars so far. Oh, kitty, you leaving me? Cool. Yeah, yes, we're ready. We didn't see anyone suspicious out here. Let's do this fast. Right, All right, Cisco. I'll handle the talking. You watch for Templars. I like how we were waiting outside. Carl, just let me talk to him. Okay. What you talk to him? See, I don't like the fact that they mark these on the map, but you can't go in them. See Daisy. Certainly, is there anything, before we go this way? Is there anything over here? I need loot. I had to loot. Oh. Do you? What is this? What is this? That's forty. What's this one like? Fifty-six plus thirty-three attack. No, one chance is better. She's tanky. She tanky tank. Raven feather. Okay. Right behind you, Hawk. Okay. Loot, loot. Quick saves. I always do quick saves now because of a the bug and b a lot. All right, this is Anders. I know you too well. Oh God, you would never do that. He's tranquil. What's wrong? Why are you talking like I was too rebellious, like you? The Templars knew I had to be made an example of. No. How else will mages ever master themselves? Jesus Christ. You understand, Anders. As soon as the Templars teach you to control yep, yourself. Yep, it was a trap. It was a trap. This is the apostate. No! Oh! Oh, I forgot about that. Okay. You will never take another mage as you took him. Okay. Damn. Forgot about. I forgot Anders was like this. Forgot about that.
on, we got this. There we go. I... Anders, what did you do? It's like... You brought a piece of the Fade into this world. I had already forgotten what that feels like. I thought the Tranquil were cut off from the Fade forever. Hmm. When you're Tranquil, you never think on your life before. But... It's like the Fade itself is inside, Anders. Burning like a sun. Please, kill me before I forget again. I don't know how you brought it back, but it's fading. Carl, no. Maybe we can find a cure. Can you cure a beheading? The I dreams mean, of tranquil mages I know are you... severed. There is nothing left of them to fix. I know you can't. I would rather die a mage than live <sighs> a Spoiler alert, but I do know you can if they they need to discover either in the end of this game or That you can either the, another against game or in the next one Inquisition that you can reverse it. But the tranquil I've met seem content with their lot. Maybe it's not that bad. You have no idea. Your emotions, your dreams, everything stripped away on someone's whim. If I were made tranquil, I would wish for a friend compassionate enough to kill me. Okay. Oh, I'm sorry. Did it matter what no, we chose? It's fading. Why do you look at me like that? Goodbye. <laughs> we should leave before more Templars come. Also, he was a witness and a triangle witness. So you could literally have no that wasn't problems. That was normal magic you just did, was it? Running us out. So. I, this is hard to explain. When I was in Amaranthi, I met a spirit of justice who was trapped outside the Fade. Yep, this is we the awakening. Friends, and he recognized the injustice that mages and faders face every day. And that's different than a demon. Just as demons prey on the deadly sins of mankind. There are good spirits who embody our virtues. Mm. Spirits of compassion, fortitude, justice. Yes, they are the makers and no. of us children. And they have all but given up on us. What does this have to do with your eyes glowing? To live outside the Fade, he needed a host. I offered to help him. We were going to work together. Bring justice to every child ever ripped away from his mother to be sent to the circle. But I guess I had too much anger. Once he was inside me, he changed. Or he was always like that. Then he just put on a front for you. Because the lines blur between demon and spirit and dragon age. So you have this spirit of justice living in your head? It's not like that. He's gone now. He's part of me. Hmm. It's not like we can have a conversation. I feel his thoughts as my own. Not even the greatest scholar could tell you where I end and he begins. That's true. This is obviously difficult for you. I thought I was helping my friend. He would have died, I guess. If that even means anything. And he wanted to help me. He knew what mages have suffered. Of course. No harm ever comes from good intentions, even when magic is involved. Normally, I would argue that. I wanted to do well by justice, I really did. But my anger, when I see Templars now, things that have always outraged me, but I could never do anything about, he comes out. And he is no longer my friend, Justice. He is a force of vengeance, and he has no grasp of mercy. We're not gonna flirt here. Can justice ever be separated from you? I don't think so. The only way a spirit has ever been separated from a living host is by its death. The curses of my own making. Hmm. 
All I can do now is hope to control it. Can you bring him out at will? No. He comes only when I've lost all power over myself. It's a madness, a frenzy. I only find out after what I might have done. Is there anything I can do for you? You're the first one I've ever told this. Thank you for not running away. Yeah. My maps are yours. Is a good As boy. am I, if you wish me to well, join sir. your expedition. I thought I was done with the Grey Wardens. But if you have any need of me, I will be waiting here. Okay. Increase our cunning. Get more constitution, then we'll just up all the strength. Where we go to continue the rest of these? Freedom. Let's see. All right. Let's see what we have. A lot of rumors. Wait, what? Okay. He's gonna keep looking for that. I guess he's gonna come back to us or not. Okay. Okay. Maka and Hightown in the day doing the chancery. Okay. Okay, interesting. Wayward Sun. That's should be. Oh, right, 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 okay. That's the one I have to go find a bunch of stuff. That's where the coast will do it. Okay. Okay, I remember this. It's coming back to me now. Okay. Okay. Um, where'd we go? Basically, we're just gonna be going to the areas that have the most quests at once. That's one. What is this quest? Oh, right, right, the docks. Alright, let's do this one though. Oh, right, straight ahead. This, this. Well, there's resistance to everything. And 
knock them all down. Them coterie men had me for sure. I guess the whole thing was a trap. Your voice does no not suit your when age. I went to make the trade, just coterie waiting to kill us. They got the rest of the boys. I ran. I was hoping they wouldn't find me here, but they did. Okay. Is that a Thenrail's rival criminal guild or something? More like she's their rival. A small one at that. Huh. What I hear is the coterie controls most crime in Kirkwall, and they don't like competition. Okay. You're a bit young to be doing this. I'm 15, but I can usually pass for a man. Oh, with that my voice, but I'm confused. By one of them big horn darks born. It's just me and my sisters now. Working for a Thenril's the only way to feed the girls. Why not take what a Thenril gave you and start fresh somewhere outside of Kirkwall? Hmm. What do you mean? Most farmers will always take extra hands for the field, or girls for the kitchen. My father was a farmer, before the Darkspawn got him. I'd rather do that than work for a Thenril. Yeah. Go do that, we'll tell, we'll tell a Thenril that cottery store. I, I'll get my sisters. Please, make sure she doesn't come after us. Yeah, we'll just tell them the cottery got it. We couldn't go back. What's the last one? Yeah. Cool. God, I love that this, like, the added detail of, like, the blade, blade at the end for, like... <sighs> I don't know why Dragon Age 2 gets, like, the wrath of being, like, the worst one in the series. Hi, Evil Queen, how are you? I hope you're doing better. Sorry, that sucks. Well, I hope <laughs> I hope my voice can calm you down a little bit. Cheer you up a little bit. Well, are you here to socialize or did you bring my goods? I rescued your boy and killed the coterie. But your property was long gone. Coterie. I should have figured. They've got a lock on all trade with the dwarves. If I'd had someone decent on the job, they'd have dug into it first, not walked in blindly. Well, no cargo, no coin. If you're ever looking for more work, I keep my books right here. Feel free to sign yourself up. Okay. You need to keep your books right here. Good job, Hawk. Oh, does she mean she just stands there? Is that what she's saying? Is I. Oh, we should go to Fenris's mansion. So. Everyone always brings up the name. I've not heard of Sir Aveline. Is she very famous? Really? They don't tell of her glorious downfall into winter. Not to slaves. <laughs> Pardon me for saying so, but thank the Maker for that. Oh, I hope so. I hope you're doing better. 
<laughs> Thank you. I'm gonna help to cheer you up if, you know, if I can only do a little bit. I know I can't do much, but... I don't know, maybe I can put a smile on your face. I think that's what I like the most about streaming. It's just like, interaction with everyone. And making people feel better. So... At least that's what I've always liked about my favorite streamers, is they make people feel welcome. And they, you know, cheer them up. Uh, help wanted! What is this? Says with the girl, my dear wife, then has gone missing, blah blah blah. High town market. Okay. Upstairs? Upstairs. What do you mean you can't help me? This is a domestic matter, Sirrah. If your wife has chosen to leave you, there's nothing we can do. Ninette is my wife. She's legally bound to me. Ugh. We're done here. I'll be the guard, too. Useless. Why are we still paying those slugouts? I intend to claim the reward for finding your wife. You are going to look for Ninette? Finally, someone who looks competent. I'll, I'll look for her. It doesn't mean I'm going to bring her back here. She needs to be dragged home. Ugh. The guards disagree. They are Not that more attitude. disagreeable than my wife. Maybe your friend is more sensible. Her family is getting suspicious. They think I might have done something to her. Even if... Well, I just want to make sure they know I didn't do it. I mean, normal. Normally, I agree with that, but let's see if I can always help the wife, maybe. Do you think Nanette might be in trouble? It's a wrong doing. Gallivanting about with men half her age. Huh, can you blame her? She's just trying to show me I am tied to her purse strings. God, you're a douche. You're more concerned what her family thinks than what happened to her. Ninette keeps the company of other men, huh? And makes no secret of it. I'll be better off with her gone. <sighs> well, as long as her family knows I had nothing to do with it, they would ruin me otherwise. You don't care that Ninette might be hurt or dead. You sicken me. Where are you? you have never lived with her. Huh? It wasn't always like this. We were in love. She defied her parents to marry me. Then you became okay. a douche. I wonder if I dreamed those years. You're more concerned what have Whoopsie. Mm. Same dialogue. Okay. I wonder if I dreamed those years. How long has your wife been gone? About a month. I wasn't worried at first. <laughs> She's run off before. Has she now? It is uncontrollable, you see. She comes and goes as she pleases. Why would her family... They think I married her for her inheritance. And they know it. They believe this is reason enough for me to hurt her. But I swear, on Andraste's pyre, I have done nothing. I'll try my best to find Ninette and bring her home. You should talk to Jethan at the Blooming Rose. I didn't know she visited whores. Until Jethan sent a letter to our house. He even sent her flowers once. Lilies. Mm. Her favorite. Jesus <laughs> Christ. Welcome, merchant. Cheating is never okay, but seeing people like that is like, oh. It's one thing if you're separated, but, ugh. Both parties are doing wrong. Have you seen him? Please, can you help me? My brother. What happened to your brother? Karen was always so devout, so idealistic. He was so proud when the Templars accepted him. I pleaded with him not to join the Order, but he wouldn't listen. You mm. hear dark rumors about the Templars and Knight Commander Merrick. 
Or what do people say about Knight Commander Meredith? Oh, she has many admirers. They lord of the service she does in keeping the mages in check. Gross. But others say she is terribly fierce and utterly without pity. That she sees demons everywhere. Who are you? You're pretty. It's dangerous even to whisper such things. What have you heard about the Templars? People harboring escaped mages just disappear. Templars interrogate and threaten passers-by. My that sounds about right. has a cousin who's a mage, and she says he was made tranquil against his will. You hear more with every passing day. Yeah, that's Night Commander Merida for you. I'm here to help you. Just tell me what you know. Karen would write me every day. Then suddenly, no more letters. I wrote him many times with no response. I tried to see him, but Knight Commander Meredith threw me out. They won't tell me anything. Your okay, brother may indeed be in trouble. What can I do for you? Perchance, in your journeys, if you find yourself in the gallows, ask the other recruits, Wilmard and Hugh, about my brother. Okay. They were Karen's closest friends in the Order. If anyone knows Pretty sure we have to go to gallows anyways. Them. Make a blessing. What? Oh, Golden Rose. Uh -oh. Let's go to Fenris's mansions first. Good boy, Fenris's mansion. Agrigio Pavali. There are six bottles in the cellar. Denarius used to have me pour it for his guests. My appearance intimidated them, he said, which he enjoyed. I can't imagine why they would be put on. You say what's on your mind. I'll give you that. We want Fredverse. This is a Fredverse friendly stream. Oop. It's good I can still take pleasure in the small things. Hmm. You've had a difficult life. I'd rather not speak more of it. Are you certain? I'm willing to listen. <laughs> to my whining? Very charitable of you. I've wanted to leave my past behind me, but it won't stay there. Good boy, Fenris. Tell me, have you never wanted to return to Ferelden? I grew up in Ferelden. It will always be my home. The blight is over. You could rebuild what you lost. Do you truly not want to? Even if I wanted to, Kirkwall is my home now. Yeah. Having a place where you can put down roots, I understand. Still, to have the option must be gratifying. Do you intend to keep living here? I haven't decided. For now, it's as good as any other place. I would return to Saharan if I could, but there is no life for me there. Saharan? Is that where you're from? So I've been told. Were you very young when you left then? Perhaps. Okay. You could track your former master down, I assume. I imagine he has returned to Minrathus, though I dare not go near the city while he is alive. Yeah. Uh, it is better to wait for him to leave his fortress, fight from a fortified position. I do not expect your help when that day comes, but I would not turn it aside. You've been on the run a long time then. Three years now. Oh damn. Denarius has a way of finding me. Perhaps it is the markings. Whatever the means, it never takes him long to follow. This is the first time I've given him reason to pause. I suppose there are advantages in numbers. Haven't you sought help before? Hirelings, when I could steal the coin. Never anyone of substance. Until you. Hmm. Denarius will not Good. give up, however. I await his return. What if he does give up? What then? Then I go to him. I will not live with a wolf at my back. Sounds like the right idea to me. Yeah. If it comes to that, I doubt it will. 
If you're looking to start a life, you could stay. I could see myself staying for the right reasons. Yes. I should thank you again for helping me against the hunters. Had I known Anso would find me a woman so capable, I might have asked him to look sooner. All right. We're going to romance Fen uh, Fenris in this. As I say, Fenrir. Uh, Fenris. I want, last time I played this, I romanced Anders. And Ro Anders has a very complicated story. So, let's go with good boy Fenris. Maybe I should be thanking Answer. Maybe you should. Perhaps I'll practice my flattery for your next visit. With any luck, I'll become better at it. Go by Fenris. Okay. Alright, time to continue. I have to go. Get right up. Trip about. Uh oh. Get what the pub was called. We have to go there. <coughs> yeah. Right over here. Blooming Rose. Oh. It's not a pub, I forgot. It's not a pub. It is... So, Elf. Whorehouse. The thing you do with your hand. I can already tell this isn't going anywhere pleasant. I bet that makes pickpocketing easier. I'll try it sometime and find out. <laughs> Jesus Christ. God damn it, Varric. Stop upsetting our party members. Well, at least he's not Ogren. Ogren is horrible. Conchoy is sexually harassing. Place. Let's not stay here for long. Madam Lucine runs the place for Harlan. Hmm. Or with him. Or on him. It's a coterie thing. Oh, this is run by the coteries. Okay. Are okay. you safe, Fenris? No. You know, some guards give people the opportunity to lie if it will keep the peace. You can see what I am. Lie to yourself if you must. Anna. Uh, boots. I don't really have any fire damage spells, but I'll take the better armor. I remember you. Today's my rest day, but I'll make an exception for you. What can I say? Why work? Hello, Elven Twink. Hard? Oh, Your Jesus son? Christ. Have you seen Nanette lately? Nanette? Not for several weeks, which is a shame. I enjoy her company. I hear she finally left her worthless husband. Good for her. I just <laughs> wish she'd said goodbye. Jesus Christ. I already feel her. I'd say he's gay, but I'd say gay vibes, but no. He gives me very twinky energy. Bisexual twinky? Did she tell you she left her husband? No. I just hope that's what she did. Ghislain only wants her for her family's wealth. Ninette's a jewel. Elegant, worldly, just the perfect level of depraved. Ghislain doesn't deserve her. Perfect level of depraved that's a way to put it okay do you think Nanette has come to harm I hope not everyone loves Nanette sometimes twice a night <laughs> oh my god Gislaine's the only one who might hurt her and he doesn't have the balls for it okay fair Gislaine knew about you and Nanette did he talk to you the man is incapable of talking he came here, yelled at me, called me a dirty knife ear, among other things, and accused me of corrupting his wife. We had him thrown out. Well, he called you a knife ear, so that's even more points off. Hardy didn't like him, but now he's just racist, too. Gross. 
Were you hoping Nanette would leave Ghislaine for you? Of course not. I know my place. I offer a service, that's all. Uh, anyway, yes. there was someone else looking for Nanette. Oh. A Templar. I believe his name was Emmerich. He wouldn't sleep with me either. Ooh. I can't see why a Templar would be interested in anyone who isn't a mage. Any chance Ninette's an apostate? Well, she certainly cast a spell on me. Alright, I'm done with your puns. Anyway, if Ninette was a mage, I think Emmerich would have said so. Someone else Ninette spent special alone time with, perhaps? Hmm. She always liked men in uniform. You could ask him yourself. Emmerich said he'd continue his investigation in Darktown. You could see if he's still there. And if you find Nanette, tell her to drop by and see me sometime. The way he just thrust with his hands. No. Oh, he has his own personal quest? Back again. Sure you're not interested in my many, many services? Oh. Okay. So it's not a quest marker, is it? Do I want to hook up with this marker? <laughs> yeah, no, I'm good. I was just passing through. Have it your way. I'm good. <laughs> Literally, the services, and I don't know. He didn't really ask you to wear a feather boa. All Asians, darling. You get used to it. <clears throat> What did he say? What time? Um. What is it? You say low town? Oh, dark town. Talk to Anders. Uh, one sec. I back. Sorry about that. <sighs> Gotta talk to Anders too. <sighs> but no. Fucking services? I don't want don't that. <sighs> Unless it's Fenris' services, I don't want it. In this game, at least. Oh. Hello, Anders. I had a friend like you once. Got in all kinds of trouble. Dragged me along. Didn't think I'd be doing that Warden? again. I got a bit weighty the last time we talked. Sorry, right. Oh, is he talking about Ogren? Oh, God. You didn't tell me anything. Anything? Be careful what you offer. I just... I hope I didn't seem too selfish when I told you about justice. I didn't know what would happen. I figured a willing host, a friend. It had to be better than playing the demon and haunting some corpse. We can't always predict the outcome of our actions. We can only make them with a true heart. Kind, wise, and beautiful. And I, oh. You must have made a deal with some demons yourself. I'm sorry. No, not I yet. I shouldn't presume. I just... We've hardly met, and I feel like I know you. Am I making you uncomfortable? Um... <laughs> I'm just gonna say it's unexpected. We're not gonna cross Ender's off our list, but Fenris is ours. Doesn't mean I want you to stop. I'll keep that in mind. I warn you, though, 
I'm not a safe man to get involved with. I'll hurt you. The second option, though. I don't mind a little pain. Apparently, our hawk is into BDSM. Hurt me. I might like it. Jesus Christ. No. <laughs> you saw what I did in the Chantry. That's who he I am. He just says flat out no. A year ago, maybe we could have had something. But I'm not that man anymore. And that might kill me as surely as the Templars. Hmm. Okay. <laughs> yeah, we're going with Fenris though. Fenris, good boy. Andrew's also a good boy, but a little bit too messed up. Also, how much gold do we have? Uh, no, we only did four. Okay. Is that all of them? No. Say Andrasi's tits. Jesus. I thank you, Sira, for coming along when you did. I am Sira. I don't know Just the person I was looking for. I need to speak with you about Nanette. Ah, Gislaine de Karak's wife. Her disappearance interested me. I tried looking into it. Hmm. However, the investigation has been a waste of time. Waste of time? Why? Did you learn nothing? Most people just say she left her husband. This all started when Meren, one of our circle mages, disappeared. I found it odd. She was a bit older hmm. and hardly adventurous. Then I heard about Ninette and two other missing women. I had a friend who disappeared once. Turns out he was under my bed, drunk. What? I think the Jesus disappearances Christ. are connected, yeah. and I suspect foul play is involved. Oh. Doesn't the Circle use phylacteries to keep track of its mages? We followed her phylactery to a foundry, but found nothing. I had heard of sympathizers smuggling mages through Darktown. Hmm. So came here hoping to pick up the trail, but no trace of Marin. And as you've seen, asking the locals hasn't made me very popular. I mean, you're a Templar, so yeah. Not exactly the best business to be into. Have you mentioned any of this to the city guard? They say there's no proof the disappearances are connected. They think the women just left home, that it happens all the time. Jesus Christ. People don't just disappear. Perhaps they were murdered or kidnapped. We found no bodies, no ransom notes. Those women just vanished. It's so weird. Okay. Did they leave dead? No. Mages routinely flee the circle. Perhaps Marin just wanted freedom. She had always been loyal. She received lilies from an unknown suitor, and some of us thought she may have gone to meet him. Perhaps her disappearance is linked? No, because it wasn't an unknown suitor. It was from, um... Twinkie Boy. The prostitute. For lack of a better word. S word? Can I assist your investigation? 
It's no longer my investigation, Sirrah. You may take over if you wish. This battle showed that I'm no longer the warrior I used to be. Okay. I know when to walk away. Here, take my findings. Perhaps you can make more use of them. I'm going back to the gallows. I'm too old for this. Hmm. A foundry in Lotan. I should look into that. Okay, let's go look into it above. Stop. Start up the stairs. So much fire damage, but not enough. Alright, Evil Queen. Sleep well. Thanks for stopping by. I always appreciate when you stop by. And I hope you have, you know, a better time. I hope you feel better. I'm sorry about that. Yeah, thank you for stopping by. I appreciate it. Sleep well. Off to a town we go. I thought all dwarves had beards. Where's yours? I misplaced it, along with my sense of dwarven pride and my gold plated noble cast pin. <laughs> <laughs> I thought maybe it fell onto your chest. <laughs> oh, the broody elf tells a joke. Jesus Christ. I don't brood. Friend, if your brooding were any more impressive, women would swoon as you passed. They'd have broody babies in your honor. You're a very odd dwarf. <laughs> and you thought I was joking about the pin. <laughs> My god, I love them. Uh, Alright, what's up, girl? This is down. Oh god. Oh, cool. So, yeah, more than one class here now. Okay, cool. Okay. 
around here. Fuck, mage? A mage who's running away. Oh. This... Oh, it's even. Okay, desire demon, bring it, bitch. Abominations. Oh, well, your mage is dead. Oh, multiple. Oh my god. Okay. Not good. And abominations, which means a mage was turned. He's not stuck. Wait, how was there anything up here? No. Just a pet. Sack of bones. Oh, and that's ring. That's a distinctive ring. Can I have it? A severed hand, a ring, and a pile of bones. Emmerich will want to see this. And I should bring the ring to Gislaine. It might belong to Ninette. Oh no. Oh, and there's like furnaces here. Oh, Jesus, were they just burning the bodies that didn't work? That they couldn't control? Oh, that's gross. So it's like slavery meets demonic possession. Alright, let's get this other one. The... Pin something. All of them, I think. Uh, 
Nope, nope. There's more. Is that all? What are these? Okay, so these are both meant for... Oh, and first with level up. Okay, good to know. Because, yeah, because that's a unique weapon to him. Why is this... I don't understand the armor that's restricted to me. For me. Good job in there. In fact, get rid of any other groups like that, and I'll be at the hanged man with some toys as reward. Courtesy of some interested friends. Well, how about that? Hmm. I wonder if it's a uh, Red Jenny. Let's go confront uh, Aveline's boss. Took me a second to get going. Good day, Sir Roth. What is Sir Roth? What does that mean? How dare you! I am God's captain! I won't be treated like this! Ferelden, bitch! This was none of your affair! I'll see you hanged! Quartered! This Fuck will yourself. not stand! We found a number of debts to suspect peoples. Such poor character. <laughs> but you, Aveline Valen, have proven your loyalty and ability. The guard deserves better than him, Messer. Indeed. The Viscount would have you put your care for the men into direct practice. You <gasps> will assume Good. the captain's job. What? In due time, of course. There will be training, approvals, months at least. But who better to rebuild respect than the woman who exposed this? Hey. Good. Resolve any outstanding Oops. business, guards, woman. Sorry. You Let's will be mic. very busy. Hmm. Okay. Well, I'm glad. Well, I'm glad that worked out for her. Not much room in the barracks, but there's nowhere I'd rather be. Always where you need. All right. Well, can you come out here where I need you? Varric, no. Hmm. We are the captain, or you will be. It'll be easy. I'm not petitioning the Viscount to help you steal ownership of the Hanged Man. <laughs> steal, madam. You wound me. I'm about to. God damn it, Varric! What are you doing? Big changes are coming, huh? Captain of the Guard. Thank you, Wesley. Uh, 
That's rude. That you keep his memory speaks well of him. He's not with me. I know that. Wesley's at the Maker's side, or he's not. Either way, he knows no pain. What I keep is that moment. I won't let anyone down like that again. Hmm. Wesley's at the Maker's side, or he's not. What do you mean by that? Wesley believed, and if he was correct, then that's where he is. But this business of the less the Maker does, the more he's proven, I don't find it compelling. But you married a Templar. I married a man, a good one, and he's gone. Quite I have heard the chant. It is lovely. Perhaps that's all it needs to be. You clearly miss Wesley, but that's not the issue. Of course I miss him, but he's not coming back. Pining like a child serves no one. So what? I remember him, but I let him rest. You're okay. not so kind to yourself, though. Yeah, I was gonna say that. No. I love the subtle no after the dialogue ends. I don't see how you can take the blame for the Darkspawn Horde. I didn't cause his death, but I also didn't prevent it. Do you blame me? I did. I didn't want to. I know why it had to be done, and so did Wesley. But in my heart, that cut was cruel. Okay. I can't imagine the captain of the guard will like wandering in my shadow. It's not like this job means we're on opposite sides. The good you do, it seems rather appropriate. Hmm. Besides, I'll be making a patrol schedule, and I don't intend to lead from a desk. I look forward to working with you, Guard Captain Aveline. Still strange, isn't it? Captain of the Guard. Not really. Thank you for helping me get here, Hawk. It's where I should be. Really that well, okay. Even the Elven people say Sarah. So the Viscount must be terribly busy. So I go for Elven then? I don't know. So why are the companions stuck in that room <laughs> that one room? I've heard about the circle of magi outside of the Imperium, but I've never been in one. Oh, we're gonna go. Are you certain it's wise for you to be here? Maybe not, but we'll be cautious. This seems more like a prison. I wonder if it's more effective than the circle I know. Hmm. How is the Imperial circle of magi different? Once upon a time, it was as it is here. The Chantry watched the Magisters closely for any signs of corruption or weakness. Then it changed. The Magisters were permitted to watch over their own, and Templars kept only to enforce the law. What happened next was inevitable. The Magisters rule again, as powerful as they ever were. Huh. You said the Chantry used to watch the Magisters. Why did they stop? You must remember that the attitude towards magic is different in Tavinta. Oh, yeah, definitely. Magisters came from wealthy families, bloodlines that had nurtured magical talent for countless God, generations. I can't wait for the Chantry was not trying to control poor peasants, but the scions of the greatest houses in the Imperium. I thought the Magisters had been thrown down by the Chantry. On the contrary, Andraste never defeated the Imperium. A great army conquered the south, but not the north. The Magisters eventually surrendered to the Chantry, but they did so on their terms. They kept their influence. Thus, they reclaimed what they, they lost over the centuries. Don't they man? Some battles are Heard lost they worship by inches. Heard they in the Chantry. A little change. You talk about the Magisters as if they are all evil. I have no doubt that some are good and noble men, strong enough to resist temptation. But how many temptations do you wish to offer a man before he will give in? Blood magic is everywhere in Tevinta, from the lowliest apprentice up to the Archon himself. You can't have seen this for yourself. <laughs> Daenerys talked about it often. Of course, they say it's forbidden, 
Behind the smiles and closed doors, however, it's a different matter. To be a magister in Tevinter is to be glorious. <laughs> to be a powerful like magister racism, in Tevinter, the closed doors. that uh, is worth trick. any price. You're saying the same thing could happen here? If the mages were permitted to be their own watchers? Of course. It is too easy for a mage to resort to blood magic if they feel the need is great enough. A mage can desire power, justice, revenge, protection. Any cause will do, and then they are lost. You can't say every mage is corrupt. All I am saying is the Imperium offers no answer. Hmm. All that Andraste did long ago to end the tyranny of magic has been undone. Power corrupts, as they say, and mages have power enough already. Treating every mage like a criminal isn't the answer. And not every mage deserves the benefit of the doubt. Freedom is a noble ideal, but I see no oppression here. I see fear and danger. But enough. I'm sure we came here for a reason. I mean, just like the, just like people, everyone's good or bad. Or not. Not like that. I meant uh, it's not black and white. I mean. Sorry, no. Can't hate every mage because one mage is bad. Do you know a recruit named Karen? His sister is looking for him. We cannot speak to you, Messiah. To the void with that. Karen and the others are missing. But our orders. The knights aren't doing anything to find them. Maybe it's time to ask for outside help. I wasn't even certain Karen was missing. Who else is gone? The first ones disappeared weeks ago. There's been at least half a dozen. Oh, Rumor and Karen were the most recent. Why must you keep silent about Karen? You obviously aren't a Templar, Messer. A Knight Lieutenant gives you an order and you obey, without question. They told us not to breathe a word about Karen and the others. They sure, must much. have their reasons. And that'll be a great comfort if you go missing next. Yeah. You can trust me. I'm only trying to keep Karen safe. I hear that Knight Commander Meredith has some new initiation you have to go through. If you're not strong enough or fervent enough in belief, you don't make it out alive. Seems to me a weak Templar would die just as quickly. And you honestly believe that? Recruits keep going missing. Wilmot came back. What? He did. I saw him this morning. What else do you know about the initiation? You hear about some questionable things that the like Order must do mustache. these days. Kiss me the Knight Commander only wants Gives me Templars to do mustache. what oh, must be done. Mustache. And trust they alive. She's killing recruits that might question her orders, isn't she? That's rubbish. She wouldn't do that. All right, Karen, calm down. If Wilmot came back, he might know more about the other missing recruits. I bet he would. Wilmot told me he was going outside Kirkwall. Clear his head, he said. Why didn't you tell us this? Knight Captain Cullen ordered it. Right before he chased after Wilmot. Cullen? That wasn't of too course, long Cullen. Ago. If you hurry, you may catch them on the road. Oh, Cullen, I love Cullen. Maker. Here are him of repentance. I love Cullen, but I don't like him as a how far. Does that make sense? You might want to see this. This was left in the foundry you mentioned in your notes. I was also attacked by shades. These are human bones. Then there is no chance of finding Meren alive, or any of the others. This isn't over. I'm going to get the bastard that did this. I know how you feel, Sirrah. My people have been slow to react, but this needs official support. I will bring this to the city guard immediately. It should be enough to convince them the disappearances are worth investigating. Bring it to the city guard immediately. Avalon standing right there.
Oh, okay. Alright, so he's continuing his search. Good to know. Is brooding a sport? Wait, oh. Winter. I want to hear that. Competitions and our trophies for the best scowls. I'm not brooding. <laughs> Moping, then. You seem like you're a champion at it. I'm perfectly content at the moment. Oh, so that's you smiling. He probably is resting the choice. that. I'd never have known. Alright, cool. So, my quests are pretty much outside of this. Lawless camp. Abandoned ruins. The bone pit. One coast. Uh, let's start with this one. Ambush. Enemies block the path. Okay. Quick save. Oh god. Fork in the road, left or right. Looks like it leads to the same way. Ooh, you flower. Lot. Can't get a decent blade at a bargain anymore. Oh, you're... you though, you're what a man needs a skilled enthusiast. Your mess just picked me up from way by. Still better than what I had. Look, the name's Javaris Tintop. I need someone to help pacify the Kunari. Why do I get the feeling he's not talking about singing them a lullaby? Oh, I thought this Those was the uh, brother. That explodes, and it's just dust. No lyrium, no demons. Anyone can use it. It's called gunpowder. I look at every second idiot and think, he needs more power. So it's some kind of Kunari magic. What use is that to a dwarf? If it is magic, it's a kind you can assemble, and dwarves do that very well. Hmm. But that Aerishak, he won't deal. And I have the same mercenary disease as their outcasts, the Talbashoth. He says I'm not worthy, but he had this look in his eyes. So I figure I'll hire some blades and... And you're going to prove yourself by killing Talbashoth out. She's a Christ. being, I'm no warrior, but I can pay. Your people must have something like that already. Small things shaped to crack faults, not shatter the earth. Plus, they're mostly lyrium. Expensive, poisonous, the Chantry controls it topside, the glow makes you a target. A problem after problem. What's the point when we already have magic that can do the same thing? Maybe you have magic, all tough and human and whatnot. But what of the common ma- How does he remove stumps from his land, or produce them on his enemies? What does he do when he needs a hole far too- Magic is hard to market. But this stuff, this stuff you can put in a bag. All right, I'll step in for you. For a price. I'm mm. done bargain hunting. I want it done right. Now, best I could figure, they're up the wounded coast, a whole camp. Take their heads off and meet me at the compound in Kirkwall. Get this right, and we'll be... Okay. That's what saying. I don't know exactly if I want to kill fucking Kunari outlaws. Especially because you never know the reason. Like, you don't know why they're told to show off. They could be just running away. So. 
I don't like the idea of just killing them. Oh my god, is this the same? Was I in the right area already? Or was this a reused area? He's just a reused area. And trust they be my witness, Wilmot. I will have the truth from you now. Mercy, sir. Mercy. Were it that easy? Don't hit me. Jesus Christ, Colin. I will know where you're going, and I will know now. I thought Templars only treated mages this badly. Nice to see you're branching out. This is Templar business, stranger. Shut up, Colin. <laughs> you have struck me the last time, you pathetic human. To me! Oh, great. Make her preserve us. Uh, early on, Colin is so fucking easily shaken. involved in something sinister but this is it even possible do you think he was possessed normally we only worry that mages will fall victim to possession I have heard of blood mages or demons in solid form who could summon others into unwilling hosts hmm. I had not thought one of our own would be susceptible You shouldn't have been out here alone with him. I am Knight Captain Cullen. I thank you for your assistance. I'm aware of who you are. I've been conducting an investigation of some of our recruits who have gone missing. Wilmot was the first to return. I had hoped to confront him quietly, out of sight. If you didn't know he was possessed, why draw your sword on a recruit? He'd only been back a few days when he left again secretly. It set off some warning bells. I meant to scare him into a confession. He had to believe my threats were genuine. Okay, because they were. Like, even if he wasn't possessed, he could have just said he was defending himself. Like, what? That's the dumbest reason ever. Okay. The recruits believed that Meredith was conducting some sort of deadly ritual. What? That's preposterous. Recruits can be worse than a weaving circle with their rumors. There is a vigil before Templars take their arms, but the gravest danger they face is falling asleep. Do you know what happened to Wilmot while he was gone? 
Obviously more than I had anticipated. Wilmot has never been fully convinced of the Order's rules. Mages cannot be our friends. They must always be watched. I thought Wilmot might be meeting with some old friends who'd escaped the Circle. I've got friends who are mages. Are you saying they need to always be watched as well? I was at the Circle Tower in Ferelden during the Blight. Yes, and you wanted to kill everyone. And shut up, Colin. Just shut up. I still have nightmares of Aldred's depravities. Oh my god, Colin, you're such a little bitch. At least in the early games, you're such a little bitch. I was trying to find another recruit, a friend of Wilmot's. Do you know where Karen is? He also disappeared. They were last seen together at the Blooming Rose. But I have of no course. luck interrogating the uh, young ladies there. I doubt they know anything of magic or demons. I'll speak with them. You never know how much you can learn from Pillow Talk. The order would truly be in your debt if you helped us with this. Well, you're not exactly. No one at the brothel will speak with me for fear I would shut them down for serving our recruits. If you learn what you're manner also of creature did this to woman. Wilmot, cool. please come tell me in the gallows. I will ensure you are rewarded. Like Colin is such a wimp when it comes to one. He gets flustered very easily. A lot of this there is in the wood coast, so let's do. Let's go to the dump bit. This ground is cursed. Only wretched or ignorant animals would linger here. So even he can tell it's cursed. Let's investigate down here. More health food. Up here, nope. I heard a monster. Okay, six or nine armor, giddy. Giddy. Uh, mana. 
Okay. Let's go with the ropes. Kind of like that look. It's very apart, like circle mage though. Oh well. Time to go to the mines. There's a foul wind coming from that cavern. I smell death. Comforting. That's very comforting. Oh. Wait, why am I? Fine, where am I? What am I even being attacked by? this way. Or maybe it circles back around. Like if we go this way, that entrance will open up. Oh, they're fighting us.
example. Stand. That's a nice ring. I said, trusty, you came along. Them dragons would have sniffed me out for certain. Slow down. Tell me what happened here. I'll tell you what I can. But be a friend and keep your voice down. There's another dragon close by. Where did the dragons come from? We was mining a new tunnel when the wall collapsed and dragons came through. There was a bloody slaughter. Cheers. Scared out of my wits. I ran like my ass was on fire. It probably was. Only I went the wrong way. Ended up trapped here. Oh. Did anyone else manage to escape? Some of my fellows ran for the surface. I hope they made it. You should get out of here. Don't have to tell me twice. You should leave too. But don't go that way. There's this huge dragon. Ooh, I'm looking forward to it. Another dragon. And larger. Not a threat we should leave behind. Oh, trust me, we're not. First, let's check this way. You're getting all the hot photos out. Mm -hmm. Alright, cool. More armor. More armor for the fight ahead. You good, runners? Oh, it's a big boy or girl. Even that strong, I'm not worried. That was easy.
Perfect. Looks like great armor. Can't wear any of that armor. Okay. Ooh. Some more tasks here. And in ruins. This is the Dalish might know where it is one. Sorry, I took the nose. I've been sent for the man you've cornered here in the ruins. Ah, so you're the reinforcements the magistrate promised. The man you're looking for, he's holed up in the ruins. Though I doubt he's still in one piece. That bastard's to be brought in alive after all he's done? Just because it isn't you? He dragged my daughter into those ruins and killed her! I want him dead! You look like my the twink girl, we saw earlier. Uh, she wasn't his first victim. Over the years, he's taken dozens of our children, and not once has he paid for his crimes. Would you mind telling me who you are? Uh, my name is Elwyn. I'm a merchant in the city. Please, no one else cares that our children are being slaughtered like beasts. Jesus. Um. There must be some humans who would take offense to these disappearances. We're nothing to them. Even if this murderer does finally go before the courts, the magistrate won't take our word over his. Huh. Why only elves? Be prey. No one thinks twice when an elven child disappears. I'll tear his throat out myself. Thank you, Sarah. You have no idea what this means. You couldn't turn to the guards. For all my damn coin, I'm still only an elf to these shemlin. There'll be no justice for my girl in the courts of Kirkwall. Oh, also Avalanche like, oh the guards, the guards, like, yeah, if you're human, like, I, I need you to understand that, Avalanche. As good as Avalanche is, she's very much like, cop. Like, turning a blind eye to actual curves. What do you say about all this? Yes. What do you have to say? They won't go in after him. They're stalling, trying to give the murdering bastard a chance to get away. Oi now, Elf. Like we said before, you're bleeding mad if you think we'll be going against the Magistrate's orders. This murderer cannot be allowed to walk free. Then that bastard will finally get what he deserves. Thank you. Not wise, stranger. You try to take justice into your own hands. The Magistrate will have your head. Good. Only if it's reported. I must do what is right. It's murdering hundreds of people, like, fuck you. Abandoned ruins. Wait, let me go up here. Oh, cool, cool. Cool, cool.
This way. So this is Ruin Dwarven. Fire soap. What's on the center here? Shoot, shoot, shoot. Okay. Shit. What was I want to save? Been quick saving, but okay, it's over here. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. You want some of that wood in there because there's a lot of enemies in there, so. Might be a good source of gold and stuff.
fun. We've got this. Hey. We did it. Here we go. You have more magic. It's not this way, what the fuck goes this way? It's just an empty room. Oops, oh, oh man, yeah. Well, I guess it's much better. Give you a stamina one because you're running out of stamina. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. Oh. Well. You. Please, can you get me out of here? I just want to go home. Oh. Leah? Your father told us you were dead. My father? Is he safe? Kelder said that he'd hurt my family if I didn't come with him. 
Who is Kelda? The man who took me. I didn't see any injuries. Are you all right? He hit me, told me I was nothing. I begged him to stop hurting me. I didn't think he would, but out of nowhere, he pushed me away and just started crying. Don't you see? He didn't mean to hurt me. He told me. There are demons. They make him do these horrible things. We'll see about that. I'm not going to dismiss it, but... In real life, this is just an excuse. What kind of demons? What did they look like? I don't know what they look like. Oh, I so didn't actually see any of them. But Kelder told me to run, to get away so they couldn't make him hurt me anymore. Please don't kill him. It's not his fault. She is a child and does not understand. Her pity is admirable, but misplaced. I'm taking Kelder back to Kirkwall. They'll figure out what to do with him there. Maybe they can help him. Doubt it. Run to the entrance. You'll find your father there. Also, the per the person that hires was the magistrate, right? And he's an also an elf, so he said he was convicted before, but got away. Why are these fucking fast? It's so fast. It's like the World War fucking Z zombies. I'm talking about the movie ones. Not the game. Separate those and then we'll start branching down another path. I knew my father would eventually send someone. I was hoping the beasts down here would get to Are me you first. the magistrate, son? You wanted those creatures to kill you. Why? It's what I deserve. I should be torn apart, forgotten down here. Not protected by my father. The Magistrate sent me. I've never even met your father. He didn't tell you, did he? The Magistrate is my father. Serious much, yeah? He's tried so hard to keep me... ...and what I've done... ...hidden away. Not hard enough, so it seems. The Magistrate is supposed to protect the people of the city. And that includes the elves. Father is a good man. He tried to help to stop me. But he can't. No one can. That elf girl. She had no right to be so beautiful. So perfect. The demon said she needed to be taught a lesson, like all the others. Huh? The circle was supposed to help me, but they lied. They said there were no demons, that I was mad. This isn't my fault. Leah said you told her to run. Why? When he says he demons, he probably means inner Crying, like, and demons. she asked me if I was all right. After everything the demons made me do to her, she was concerned about me. How could I let them destroy something so good, so pure? Let me get this straight. You torture and murder elven children for being too beautiful. I... I didn't want to hurt them. They force me. The demons don't like it when they cry. If the Circle suspected a demon at work, they wouldn't risk setting you loose in the city. No. They lied. No. I can't stop. I've tried so many times. Please, you have to kill me. There's no other way. He sees the truth of it. Allow me to grant his wish, if you will not. A 
Any last words before he kills you, Kelder? Yeah. Just give him a friend rest. Tell my father. Might give a boost to friend rest. I'm and, sorry. Like, I don't think there's actual demons alive in here, so. Also, damn, Fenris. Alright, can I loot you? <laughs> Alright, thanks. Up. You saved her! My little girl! I didn't dare hope. Did you find that monster? Is he dead? He won't harm Leah or anyone else. Ever again. I didn't believe an elf could ever get justice in Kirkwall. I speak for all of us when I say that we are in your debt, Sarah. Sorry, Leah, but he deserved here to die. His father was just going to protect just him. just as bad for those knife ears as the next man. But ignoring the Magistrate's direct orders, that's madness. It's not. It just takes a pair that you don't have. Oops. I'm going to take a this one. This is why I'm gonna end the stream, everyone. Thank you to everyone that stopped by. Thank you to Evil Queen, Candy, thank you to Evil Queen and Candy, especially. Uh, this will be uploaded to my, my YouTube, like all my videos do. So, check my link in my profile. I also have my Twitter. Um, but thank, again, thank you to everyone who watched. It was a fun stream, and I'll probably be back with. I don't know if I'm going to be streaming Dragon Age tomorrow, but probably something else tomorrow as well. So thank you.